Oh, <laughs> shit. <coughs> Damn. Yeah. Shit, God. Yeah, nice get wide set. Fuck that shit. I, I, I ain't hitting that bitch, mom. Shit. Wake your ass up. It's the Wake and Bake Show. Live on eblockradio.com. <laughs> Check one, check two. All right, we live. Live in the motherfucking building. Loud as hell. Guess y'all niggas can hear us then, because this shit is hella loud. We only on Facebook, though. We ain't nowhere else. Oh, we on IG and shit. So as I turn it on. All kind of weak shit. Can't believe the niggas banned us, though. It's weak as hell. <laughs> some shit happened three months ago. No, all right. The fucking shit was like three months ago. Oh, man, that's right. Since the old man can't see this shit enough, because he watching on YouTube. Mm-hmm. Damn. We're going to miss out on a lot of shit today. You about to, we about to hear him. You a question. <laughs> like, right, nigga, we on, cut. Show ain't on, nigga. I'm telling you, it ain't on on YouTube. <laughs> right. Hello. Right, I can't see the brother's fucking. <laughs> you can move that shit up. Take it up the wire. The box, and we're going to get it out the way. There you go. Are we live in this bitch, man? Let's go, nigga. It's loud as hell. Cardio Cools, what up, though? Two Gs, what's the dilly? <clears throat> Y'all niggas normally on YouTube and shit. Our YouTube is uh has been uh, banned. We in YouTube jail until fucking May, because I hey. decided to uh <laughs> because I decided to stream the E42 short motherfucking verses. They flagged my shit and told me to get the fuck on. So we are out of commission until fucking May, but uh. All right, we in this bitch, dog. Let's do it. Got it ready? Let's go. Yo, 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 you know what it is, man. The live is cloud radio show on the planet. Earth, cuz. Straight from the E-Block Radio Live on your dial right this moment, man. This is the Wake and Bake Show. I got my man Angry Man in the building. Yo, yo. My man Monk Money holding it down. Man, you already you know. And, of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205. Man, let's get to the shits, dog. It's been a long motherfucking week because we wasn't here on Monday. Mm-hmm. Motherfucking, uh, the shit's open back up on Monday, dog. What's been popping with y'all niggas, man? I guess, how was niggas weekends and shit? Cause we ain't kicked it since Friday. Right. Since we got drunk on the show and shit. <laughs> What's been popping with you, man? Well, you'd be proud to know I did do something. Okay. Me the wife and the two grandkids. We ain't got a room for the last couple of days. That's what's up. I know what you, you didn't do, though. Huh? Did you go to work while you was there? I sure did. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna say I, I know what you didn't do though. You ain't talking to the mic, nigga. Can't nobody hear you, cuz. <laughs> no, yeah, I do. I went to work. You know, I got up from there, went to work. Yeah. When I got off work, I went back out there. Oh, okay. That's the, that's that's what's up. Yeah. So nice you feel like a regular show. person now? I mean, if that's what normal people do. I don't know, shit, is it? <laughs> yeah, y'all always say I don't do anything, so I did something. Good yeah. job, man. You ain't sound really excited about it, though. No, no, you no, rather no. have been at work and shit? I still went to work. You ain't just hear me say that? You went to work. Yeah, but did you go, like, the full, like, yeah. like how you normally do? Like, yeah. from sun up to sun down? Yeah, that, that, that didn't change. <laughs> oh, man. I guess that don't count, then. That's, yeah, that shit don't count. Motherfucker got all the vacation days and then just take two days off? Man, it's it's, on, it's crazy. I know. I ain't doing that shit. I My man Cardio there. Cool said uh, that sandwich you posted was amazing. Yeah, it was. Shout out to... Uh, chef to your doorstep, man. My man, Monk Money and shit. Definitely back in the building. Easy Street is back in business, dog. 16101 East 10 Mile Road, man. Pull up. Pull My up. man's slanging chickens out the motherfucking kitchen. Yeah, we open for <laughs> lunch, too, yo. We can come on down there and get you something before you go to work. Go oh, get, yeah, open for lunch, wings. for sure. Go get the wings, man. You fucking with wings today? It is Wednesday. Mm, I'll do 75 cents. 75 cents. All right, 75 cent wings today, man. It's the Chef to your doorstep motherfucking special. Mm-hmm. Slanging out that motherfucking Easy Street, some little kitchen. My oh, man Bo just checking in. What up, though? All the people checking in. On, all the people checking in on IG, man. All the people checking in on Facebook, dog. I do apologize if y'all was trying to get in on YouTube, uh, but we didn't get no action today because our shit got banned. Because right. my goofy ass wanted to stream the versus challenge and shit, and they flagged my shit. And we are on punishment until fucking May, so YouTube will not be live. Uh, it will be uploaded after the show. <coughs> we can't live stream from that bitch until May, so. 
I fucked that up. My bad, folks. <laughs> we go, we go work it out, though. What else popping off with you, dog? So you spending a little time with the family and shit away from the crib? No, it was just the two grandkids. Oh, just the... Oh, that don't count. That's what I thought it was the whole family. No, no, just the two grandkids. Oh. I ain't had my kids in about two weeks. Oh, for real? Oh, they going with their uh, they auntie and shit, right? Oh, yeah, I forgot about that shit. Shout out to not having no kids. Oh, shit. Oh, well, I was going to uh, shop clothes, though. I was going to say, it might be well, some more kids. Baby, yeah. Hell, yeah. <laughs> All the kids go. It's going down around this bitch. No, that bitch closed. <laughs> that shit closed. Shop is closed. Right. <laughs> Hell, no. Nah. No longer. Right, for sure, though. I, I prefer it that way. Shit, I feel you, nigga. Shit, I, I didn't, uh... Never mind. Anyway, <laughs> Black Molly just checking in. What up, though? Uh, even haters adore. What's happening, mommy? Uh, shit, what's going on with you, though? Man, these motherfuckers, bro. I, I'm I'm kind of pissed off this morning. Oh I, shit, you you angry? Yeah, I'm angry, okay. bro. What's up? First off, these motherfuckers hacked my goddamn Facebook page. Then they just took over my IG last night. Just oh, took- yeah. Oh, yeah. We got to try to fix that shit. They ain't got all of your IG. Nigga. Man, they done took over my IG. So if y'all going to be, uh, y'all probably going to get some messages from me, bro. <laughs> Motherfucking DHH. What, a um, DHHS loan or Yeah, something? yeah. So that ain't me. <laughs> Scab.com, boy. Yeah, they get me, man. That shit got me pissed off. I told them motherfuckers I'm fine. I'm going to get a... A private investigator to look for your dumb ass. See, he's, he really said that though. Like yeah. he really. Like, I'm yeah. Hell yeah. A private investigator uh-huh. yeah. to find your bitch ass. I'm not doing that much work for them. My man Joe the Vet just checked in. What up though? What's happening? It's been a super minute. My what man Joe the Vet. Yeah, there is some bullshit, man. They got us yeah, on hiatus until you too. I mean, until man. But then again, that's some bullshit too, though. But then again, the motherfucker sent me off my page. <laughs> The shit, bro. Like, right. I don't want to. I'm like, man, fuck you. That shit man. probably a computer, dog. No, nah, Bo, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, we can't go live on YouTube right now because I fucked up, dog. We in uh, YouTube jail and shit. Because I streamed the uh, Too Short E40 versus battle and shit. And they just now flagging that shit. But fucking iTunes flagged my shit. So they was like, nigga, they ain't playing. It was like, nigga, take that shit down and you can't post live and shit for, for three months. So we stuck, nigga, no yeah. live on YouTube. But after the fact, it will be going up. Just can't watch it live on YouTube, nigga. It's some bullshit because niggas be watching that shit on TV. That's mm-hmm. the only bad thing about it. I'm going to figure some shit out, though. We have to go to Vimeo or some shit, nigga. We got to do something, nigga. Three months a long motherfucking time. Long mm-hmm. motherfucking time. That's a long time to be banned and shit. But you know what, though? That means we on the right track, dog. Mm-hmm. Niggas start banning us, nigga. We about to blow up, cuz. Right. I can't wait. That's why we need to have our own shit. Like, so we just stream straight from the uh, website. Like, yeah. fuck YouTube and all that shit. All that shit. Hell because, yeah. Because uh, the motherfuckers, uh, we got some thumbs down last time. Oh, too, hell yeah. Man. I love that shit, too. Yeah. Thank y'all niggas for watching. What What's fucked up now, though, is that they was probably waiting on some new episodes and they can't get them now. Because a lot of people that uh, watch on YouTube, nigga, they, ain't, they don't have Facebook. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people don't have Facebook. So now we just got to push this shit on IT, I guess. Y'all niggas got to look at the side of my face in this motherfucker. I don't know. <laughs> what the fuck? And, or everybody just got to get Facebook, which a lot of niggas don't, though. Uh, Coco J just checking in. What up, though? My nigga Bread just checking in. What's goody? <laughs> what's good? Um, so outside of getting hacked and shit, nigga, what's, what else been popping with you, though? This nigga getting hacked. I got hacked like a motherfucker. But Easy Street Saloon, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm in and that bitch banging. For sure. You know what I mean? Like arms, soul, legs, soul, everything. So, arms, soul. You know Twitch I mean? TV. Yeah, I'm on, I'm already on Twitch. Cardio Cools. Yeah, we on Twitch and shit. But yeah, that, I mean, that's about it, though. You know what I'm saying? Trying to get Easy Street back together. Yeah. Uh, y'all come down there and holler at me, man. You know, support your boy, man. Sure. Uh, 16101 East 10 Mile Road, dog. Pull up. Slank the chickens out the kitchen, nigga. Yeah, phone number has <laughs> changed. Damn, and, the phone number different? Yep. So we gonna, we gonna, I'm going to put that out there today. Yeah, probably if y'all had a social media guy, they probably could fix that for you. <laughs> anyway, dog, so uh, <laughs> I'm right. just saying. Uh, <laughs> my nigga both say, I don't know about watching the side of your face for the entire show, dog. <laughs> <laughs> so, I know, man. I'm sorry, cuz. I see yeah, My bad. Um, you got to active and reactivate your Facebook, my nigga. Uh, let me see. Uh, Brad said, uh, work hard, uh, work hard, monk money for sure. For sure. Um, yeah, what else popping though? You ain't had time to do shit else, I suppose. Nothing else. Yeah. Well, I caught up on some motherfucking movies though. No, I didn't. Not not movies, but just one movie. Uh, I watched, uh, what's the name of that shit? The Little Things, the Denzel movie and shit. Shit was good, though. Shit was dope. What I do want to, uh, what I do want to see though is that, uh, What's that shit called? American Skin. Did you watch? Anybody watch that shit? No. It's some shit on. I think it's Netflix or Amazon. I can't. I think it's Amazon. But it's about a, a dude and his uh 
gets pulled over by the police and his son gets shot by the police and shit. Um, I ain't, I ain't see. I don't know how they how it end the shit, but uh, yeah, that, that shit oh, seemed kind of yeah, dope. Yeah, 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 I want to see that shit. Up. I think my man's did that shit. The one that did uh, oh shit, Nate, Nate, uh, what's what's the nigga name? Nate, uh, the one who did uh, the motherfucking movie that got banned and shit about the uh, about the massacre. Uh, Nate, Nate, what the fuck is Nate last name? <laughs> Bo, nigga, you know what I'm talking about. Andrews? Huh? No, <laughs> who the fuck is Nate Andrews? I don't know the nigga I'm saying at all. <laughs> I'm gonna buy late. I'm gonna buy late. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Yes, Nick, thank you, Coco J. Thank you, Nate Parker, dog. Yes, god damn it. I could not think of that nigga name, dog. I have a complete brain fart in this bitch, dog. But yeah, um, he did that shit, dog. So, uh, I know, right? I do need to pin the topic, dog. Damn, Brandon got a new phone and shit. Y'all educated on technological shit and shit, dog. Uh, but yeah, today we're talking about finances, dog. How important. Is a uh, financial stability in your mate, dog. That's what we're talking about. That's today's topic. Um, it is almost 10 30, so I guess we can pop off into that shit. I think what else popped off because we've been gone for a little while. Uh, oh, yeah, Via be back tomorrow, uh, not tomorrow, but uh, Friday. So she'll be back Friday to make some more drinks just like last week. Uh, what else happened this weekend? Matthew Stafford got traded. Oh, yeah, Staff did get traded. Some niggas was mad. I mean, some, no, nah, some niggas was happy about that shit. I, I wasn't mad, but I was like, I was sad to see him go, though, nigga. Like, I hope he gonna win and shit. I hope he gonna kick ass. Like, I know it's one thing, he gonna win a, he gonna win a couple of fucking playoff games. <laughs> that's one thing that's gonna fucking happen, so. It was kind of like the Adamus and Sue uh, factor with me. Yeah. You know, I was a Adamus and Sue fan when he was at uh, Nebraska. So, yeah. Uh, I mean, I still follow him. Yeah. So I'm still follow staff, too. Yeah, you for know? sure. I mean, All day. We ain't gonna have no choice but to follow him now. He on the winning team. <laughs> <laughs> right, I don't know what we're going to do with Jared Goff and shit, but I mean, we got the, uh, I guess we got the, the first round picks or whatever. I don't mean, know, whatever. <laughs> I, hope, I hope that was a better deal than <laughs> what you had. Right what the fuck's so funny, nigga? Oh, Jim, we so hopeful for these motherfucking Lions, bro. I, 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 yeah, we got it, nigga. I mean, man, we wish, we wish. Right, you know we saying? wish, we wish, we, we wish. wish. <laughs> Nigga, I do, man. I hope that shit turn out for real, cause like that shit funny, man. Cause that shit ain't gonna happen. <sighs> it, it, it really ain't. Right. And Damn, you, know, I'm a, you know I'm a diehard fan. Yeah. No. You know, you know I love the things, but I just didn't understand the move. I mean, I don't understand the move either. But shit, hopefully, like why did the new blood? Why did they try to get this child Watson? Go for the. I mean, if you're gonna restart the whole thing, go go with the youth. They probably couldn't afford it. Couldn't afford, afford it. Yeah. I'm, I'm sure the shine was cheaper than golf. Shit, I doubt that. Uh, uh, Hell no. Nah. Nah. I doubt that shit, nah, though. Nah. nah. I, can't, I can't agree with you on that one. <laughs> Hell no. Nah. I can't agree with you on that shit at all. But they just freed up. I'm at DeMar just checked in. They, what up, though? He said, why you laughing, cuz? <laughs> they just freed up a motherfucking kajillion dollars when they let Matthew go. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> Black Molly said, Lee, the Lions do great things. That's usually what happens. Always. Dominican Sue in the uh, Super Bowl again. Uh, <laughs> probably, again. Probably, probably got about to get one of them bitches. Uh, dog, what you think about that shit? That shit is this weekend, though. What y'all think about that shit, though? I, dog, I ain't gonna lie. I want, I want Brady to win, but I also want Young Dog to get another one and shit, though. Because, mm -hmm. like, you know, he got black in him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that'd be kind of dope and shit. Yeah, A back to back, dog. And this nigga what, 24? Oh, no, that shit'll be gully. Get but it. it'll be gangsta as fuck for Brady to lead the motherfucking uh Patriots, take Tampa Bay of all fucking teams to the Super Bowl, Super Bowl. and play at the crib. Like what? that shit like a so, fairy tale ending. Bro, bro. he's so Solidifying him to go, bro. No, like, the yeah, gets yeah, naive. Yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah, they're they're gonna to, uh, right. They gonna have to <laughs> My man Bo said fuck Brady. <laughs> <laughs> they gonna have to change that list. Yeah, oh, for sure. Even, even if Brady Talk Girl win, Tuesday, what up, though? What's happening? Even if he don't win, they're going to have to change that list. Yeah. Because I think they got him at number two. Yeah. And Joe at one. Yeah. No, they got to change. Yeah, because in, in order for Joe to be ahead of him on that, he would have had to have took Kansas, Kansas City, City to the, to the Super, Super Bowl. Bowl. That shit ain't happen. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Damn, yeah. that shit go. It's going to be a good-ass game, hopefully, though. Yeah. Like, hopefully it don't be no, like, shitty game. Because I ain't going to lie to you. I don't think it's going to be a shitty game. Bro. I ain't going to lie, though. If Brady played like he played last week, nigga, they going to get their ass beat. That nigga threw it. He yeah. was just throwing that bitch. I don't know what he was doing. Yeah. So, I don't know. Well, we going to see, though. Uh, shout out to all the people who go have Super Bowl parties this Sunday, man. Y'all niggas be safe or whatever. Yeah. Um, you, you have one? If y'all ain't having one, come up to the Easy Street for too long. I'm having one. Come check me out. A word? Yeah. Oh, for real, for yeah. real? Oh, yeah, I forgot. Like, shit, normally wasn't open on Sundays, mm -hmm. though, right? Yeah, okay. I might have to fuck around then. I might do that shit. Uh, shout out to Angry and Monk mm -hmm. looking like they about to do a moving job. 
<laughs> the moving brothers, Leroy and Mike. <laughs> Hey, y'all do, do though. <laughs> y'all do. What the fuck is this shit? Two men in the truck looking at us. <laughs> so, so, so you moved out over there. No, right. That nigga ain't even lying. That was a good ass assertion. 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 You know what I'm yeah. talking about? Yeah. All right, but uh, fuck it. That's it, dog. We're going to get to our for real topic. First, of course, we got to go to commercial break, dog. When we get back, this is what we're talking about, dog. We want to know how important. Is it for your mate to be financially stable, dog? I'm going to tell y'all how we got to this topic. Uh, when we get back, dog, it's only going to be like a minute. It's just a little commercial break, and we'll be right back. Till then, you already know what it is. The Live is Cloud Radio Show on the planet. Earth, cuz. Straight from the E-Block Radio Live on your dial, man. We'll be back in like one minute. Yeah. Wake your ass up. It's the Wake and Bake Show, live on eblockradio.com. The eBlock Radio Podcast Network loves our fans, and we need your help. Click the link in the description and become a patron on our Patreon page. You can help us continue to deliver informative and funny entertainment as we've always done. But not only that, you'll have a chance to win free gifts, cash prizes, and get access to behind-the-scenes footage, videos, and photos. So what are you waiting for? Go ahead and click that link in the description and become a patron on our Patreon page. PardonMyEastSide.com We've got t-shirts, long sleeve tees, snapbacks, skull caps, and yeah, we even got hoodies. Use the promo code eBlockRadio to get 15% off right now. Wake your ass up. It's the Wake and Bake Show, live on eBlockRadio.com Check one, check two, check one, check two. We live back in the motherfucking building, man. You already know what it is. The live Cloud Radio Show. On the planet. Earth, cuz. Straight from the E-Block Radio Live on your dial right this moment, man. I got my man Angry Man and Monk Money holding it down. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to. And, of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205. <coughs> <God> damn. <coughs> I just choked. We after the fact, dog. No, we back in this bitch. My man Demar just checking back in. What up, though? He said, uh... Oh, you got a podcast? That's what's up, dog. Uh, hit me up, dog. We uh, we rap on some shit. Uh, Deacon is five sixteen. Just checked in and shit. This motherfucking Mrs. Soul Deacon. What up, what's yo? Up? What's happening? What's we back happening? in this bitch, man. We about to talk a little shit, dog. Today's topic, for real, for real, though, is how important is it for your mate to be financially stable, dog? That's what we want to know. Also, don't forget, man, it's Wednesday, seventy five cent wings at the Easy Street Saloon, one six one zero one East Ten Mile Road, dog. My nigga Monk Money, chef to your doorstep, gonna be slanging chickens out the motherfucking kitchen. You understand what I'm saying? I'm talking about. So go ahead and pull up, man, today. Uh, Put you some mustard on the motherfucker. Mustard? I thought that was just for lamb chops. Uh, on chicken? Yeah. Man, get the fuck out of here. That motherfucker put mustard on everything. Mustard on chicken? Yeah, the way he cook them. This nigga got to just be lying. No, I'm, I've done it before at the end of the week. This nigga got to be lying. Get some of them motherfuckers. This motherfucker, motherfucker weed then went out fucking with you, dog. All right, so let's. <laughs> get some of them motherfucking wings. He could get them plain, dip them bitches in some mustard. Trust me. This, this yeah. nigga serious? I don't even want to talk about that shit anymore. All right, so we back, dog. Let's talk about this shit, man. <laughs> uh, but this this what happened. So I was doing uh my podcast from Tuesday. Shout out to the podcastic family, dog. I, uh, me, uh, my man Chef Wilson, and uh, my man Miles Dixon, D. Jones. Uh, got a show called Girth, right? So it's about it's a men's talk show. Um, so last night we was talking about uh, what uh, what's your uh, top five things that that you need to find Mrs. Right. Uh, so like it was going through the list and shit, and then one of one of the ones at the bottom of the list was uh, financial stability. So I was just curious, like how important is that shit, dog, for your mate to be financially stable, dog? Angry man, what you say, bro? How important is that shit, dog? Well, <clears throat> to me. It- it's important, but I'm not going to put it probably that high on the list. Right. You know what I mean? Because, you know, I, you know. You going to go to work 50 times a, a day. So no, it don't I matter. Just, I mean, <laughs> so it don't matter. I mean, you know, I don't knock a lot of people that, mm-hmm. you know, do 50-50. I don't knock that because mm-hmm. I don't live there. I don't yeah. know your situation. I don't know how you were raised, but, you know, the way I was taught and the way I came up and the way I do it, I pay my own bills. Mm-hmm. You know, because things happen 
You know what yeah. I'm saying? She fuck around and find Boris Kojo, nigga. You, you seen half your bills walk out the door. <laughs> now you in trouble. Damn, bitch, you still love Boris Kojo? Yeah, I guess so. Do I, don't I don't know. I don't know. That nigga like 60 now. I don't know. He's an album. Right. But nah, um, I mean, for some people, to, 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 and, and, and this is just my opinion. This mm-hmm. is just my opinion. To each his own. Mm-hmm. Some people need it. Some people don't. Some people care about it. Some people don't. Yeah. You know what I mean? I mean, I, I always walk into a situation where I feel like I'm just going to pay all the bills anyway. Okay. You know what I mean? Because like I said, I don't want to see half of my shit walk out the goddamn door. Yeah. You know what I mean? If if you offer it to me, I'm going to take it. Well, I'm saying that shit, she could be uh, she could be financially stable and, and still not be helping me with the bills. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, so. and, and, and that's my point right there. That's why, you know, I, I take care of my own shit. Mm. You know what I mean? But like I said, to, that, that, that that's that's one of those to each his own type deals to mm-hmm. me. You know what I mean? Some men will require they, you know, they made to say, no, nah, fuck that. You live here too, you do this. And I don't knock that. I know. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I said, because I don't live there, I don't have to deal with it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Some, and, and, and if that's how you run your, 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 your castle, that's how you run your castle. Right. No, for sure. You know what I'm saying? And like I said, that, that, that that's just my opinion on it. To me, it's, it's, it's a, to, to each his own. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Oh, real quick though, this, this way off subject. I, I forgot to read this uh, comment though that nigga Bo has said uh, why Eric B. Enemy ain't somebody head coach though. I honestly thought somebody was gonna pick him up as a head coach though. For real, it's coming. You think so? He probably gonna yeah. wind up in college somewhere. Yeah, it's probably. Yeah, I, he need to be somebody in NFL head coach though. Well, Cause I, he the only reason that fucking. I ain't gonna say the only reason, but he a, he a big reason behind the reason Kansas City is doing what they doing and shit for sure. No, nah, but you know Andy Reid ain't no. Yeah, I mean, yeah. he no slouch, nigga, uh, for sure. Uh, yeah. Let me see. Uh, Gigi said Bill Gates or <laughs> or or fuck E Block, man, whatever, dog. She always talking shit. Uh, Coco J said it's important, and hopefully that's their uh, goal as a couple to be financially stable together. Uh, the way shit is going now, there's definitely a little struggle now, but it can happen, dog. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. figure that shit, dog. Well, Money, well, what you uh, what you say, bro? Shit definitely helps. I'm saying sure. though, why not want more shit? You know yeah. I mean? Like, if you fucking able and, and able to work, shit, yes, why not? I want you to be financially stable. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, I'm not saying to a point where I'm I want you to take do everything. You know what, <laughs> right. what I'm saying? For sure. But at least you know what I'm saying. If if situations happens like this, like mm-hmm. the pandemic and shit, yeah. you know what I'm saying? If you got if y'all a hell of a team, nigga, that shit was lightweight then. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Because shit, y'all took care of together, hold it down together, you know what I'm saying? And um, I mean, shit, people just need the motherfucker buckle down, nigga, and, and just say what they want, you know what I'm saying? And go for it, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. put it out in the atmosphere, like, yes, I want a person that does this, doing yeah. this, with this. Because if you met her with a 460 <clears throat> motherfucking credit score, then. Yeah, well, you, what you expect, you know <laughs> right, what I'm saying? Yeah, like, for you, sure. That's exactly what you're going to get for the rest of your life, a 460 yeah. credit score. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Unless you, <laughs> unless you motivate her to get it together, yeah. and that's that's on you though. Yeah, that, and that, that, can, that can happen too though. That, yeah. that for sure can happen. Like I mean, I agree with every man to a point where you know what I'm saying you the man. You know what I'm saying you supposed to fit majority of the shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying in the first place, and, sure. and, and that's fine, said dandy, but. I want you to be doing something too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? For real. Like, <laughs> that should for real. definitely help like a right. motherfucker. For, for sure. For sure. Yeah. For sure. You know what I mean? So, I mean, <clears throat> it can happen. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And, and and that should be your whole focus. Like like uh, Coco said, like it should be your whole focus to have, you know, y'all be a great team, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? Both of y'all should both have y'all, shit together. Both of y'all. Yeah, both for y'all. Sure. You know what I'm saying? Oh, that's definitely important. You can't come in that bitch with a 460 credit no. score and expect her to have a 700. No, because no, yeah, you know it ain't just you no more. Right. You know Facts. what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Like, we've been so used to taking care of us. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Just me. Right. You know what I'm saying? Then yeah. when you get a whole squad, nigga, that I'm accountable for, nigga, I got to fucking do what I got to do. But Facts. you can help me. Help me, help me, please. Help me, please. <laughs> <laughs> and why not one more, though? Yeah, what you say? You, hey, I, I got the Wi-Fi and the kids for a cell phone bill this month, baby. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, pretty good looking out. You know what I'm I'm not going to ask you for it, but if if you bring that to the table, I'm definitely going to fucking take it. For sure. Right. Uh, my, man, my man Bo said, uh, you don't have to be uh, rich, but you got to have decent credit. Show fiscal responsibility. If you're a mess, I can't trust you, nigga. That's it. Really? That nigga say he can't trust you. Damn. For real, bro. <laughs> hey, you can't trust a motherfucker with a low credit well, score. No, like a total mess, though. Like, he, said, he said mess. I, I know. Mean, I'm just talking. 
like you well, said. Well, hold on, bro. I mean, my, my, my thing on that is you got you got to, uh, you got, what's that shit you always say? You got to know who you fucking with. You got to yeah. know. And, you know, <clears throat> sometimes somebody just need some guidance. Some guidance, yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? They, they, they could just probably never been around somebody that know what to do with, you know, with, with their finance. With their finance, yeah, for I sure. I mean, they, 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 they just could be financial illiterate. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? For sure. And then, one, you know, once they get with somebody that, you know, that could turn them, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? That, yeah. that, that that's... That's one thing you can find out real quick. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? You know, yeah. you, you, you try to slow stroke them, <clears throat> and let them know, hey, this is how we're going to do this, this is how we're going to do that. Yeah. You get rebuttal from it? Oh, no, hell no. Right. But if you get somebody that say, okay, 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 yeah. you know what I'm saying? Willing to learn the shit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, because some people just don't know. Yeah, for sure. No, that's real shit, though. Uh, the nigga also said, "Don't be over, uh, don't be overextended. If you make a hundred thousand, don't spend a hundred and five thousand. That's for sure. That, that's, that's, that's real shit. Right that's that's, that's financial. Me. That's being financially responsible. And though. it's a, no, it's a lot of people living beyond their means, dog. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, why, why, what do, you, what do you need a mink and all that shit for? <laughs> that nigga said a mink. And you ain't even got motherfucking <laughs> gas money to put in your fucking car. That nigga said a mink. Some uh, motherfuckers need to realize, you know, especially when y'all starting off." Yeah. You, you need to, some people need to start off at Aldi's instead of going to Kroger's. This nigga say Aldi's, dog. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, until you until you uh, build up your shit. You know what I'm saying? Beer sweets. We go. Uh, that's uh, what's it called. That's uh, Joe the vet. We gonna pull you in in just a second, dog. I see you uh, got a request. We about to pull you in. Uh, Coco just said the person uh, credit score doesn't define the person. All right, so look. I agree with that a little bit, all right? So I do agree that your credit score don't define you because that could have been past, you know, fuck-ups and shit, right? That's fine. But, like, once you get to my age, if that's your credit score and you not at least trying to fix it, then that do define the person. Because, <laughs> like, if you know your shit fucked up and you ain't trying to fix it, uh-huh. then that do define you. You know what I'm saying? That does define you, bro. Like, I, yeah. like the, the, the score as it is, of course not. You probably fucked up back in the day. Nobody told you about credit and shit, you know, shit like that. But then now, once you got older and nigga, all the information is out here, and you're not at least trying to fix it, mm-hmm. then, yeah, my baby shit, that's uh, yeah, that's yeah, defining yeah. you as a person. Like a motherfucker. <laughs> hell, hell yeah. You so, cause, 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 cause a lot of us did it. A lot yeah. of us did it. Because I'm, I'm guilty of it. Yeah. Me and my 20s. Getting, uh, fuck it. Oh, hell yeah. Getting cars and College shit. credit cards? Yeah. Nigga, fuck my wife up, nigga. Get, what you get, mean? Getting credit cards and buying cars and shit. Dog. Late, nigga. Late on I, payments back in the day. Bro. <laughs> Right, I had a fucking repo, nigga. Shit, I had a repo on my shit. So yeah, I had a fucked up my shit in my twenties, nigga, for sure. Yeah. Then the yeah. uh, fucking credit cards in college, nigga. <clears throat> uh, buying fucking uh, I was gonna say books, but we were still in them bitches. Yeah. <laughs> so buying my fucking pizza, nigga. I've been paying for pizza for thirty years for fucking school with Discover card, nigga. Do they even still make Discover cards, nigga? <laughs> <laughs> shit, I got about fifteen thousand dollars worth of pizza on that bitch, dog. Yeah, <laughs> Look at their chops when they saw me coming that motherfucker. Yeah. To get a goddamn uh, credit card. Nah, hell yeah. Gigi said, uh, capability and ability. We're in, we're in this together. I prefer the provider attitude, but in the moment, he ain't got it or to give some uh, breathing room than I do. Yeah, no, for sure. It should, it should be a team. Uh, both said a credit score does define a person's approach to responsibility. Yeah, that's what yeah, I'm saying, yeah. dog, for sure. Uh, <laughs> Corporate Cody said Just shove to your doorstep Make pizza <laughs> Hey shit if he did nigga, I swear I'd be ordering This nigga every day uh, Let me see Bo said that's the one thing If you're making an attempt Even if you're Financially illiterate I need some effort To correct your situation Yeah that's my thing That's all we're saying Yeah, yeah. for sure um, well, we, You know what Recognize hmm. it Cause a lot of people yeah, Try to ignore it, it. You know Yeah for sure I believe that the, uh, Let me see uh, Where we at with it all right, I think we caught up with everybody. Year the mosquito just checked in. What up, though? Uh, Beer Sweets about to bring you in, man. That's my man Joe the Vet. About to bring you in right quick. I guess he's still there. Uh, if you're on Facebook Live right now, dog, he was trying to find us on YouTube. Unfortunately, uh, because I, I streamed the, the uh, versus battle with <laughs> E40 and, uh, and uh, motherfucking Too Short, they banned us from YouTube, so we are banned until uh, May. So, yeah, YouTube not working. Joe the Vet, what up, though? What's up, though, bro? What's going on, fam? What's, What's going on, dog? What's happening, Kevin? Nothing much, nothing much. What you think about this shit, dog? I think we had this conversation on another topic before. I think he was talking about uh, a chick that, I, I, if I remember right, I think he was saying something about this. Well, I, I honestly feel that it's a mutual thing. Like, Monk was saying, you know, 
I was raised in the South, and we're raised to where the man takes care of all the bills yeah. and takes care of the house. Right. But in today's society, as I was raised and as I grew up, before my mom and my dad got married, my mom ran everything. And yeah. then when my mom and dad got married, my mom made sure that she took care of everything that my dad wasn't able to take care of. And then sometimes she'd step up and take care of the bills so my dad could have a little extra money to do what he wanted to do. Facts. Mm -hmm. That's so what's it, up. It honestly, just, it honestly just depends on the family and the situation that they're in. For sure, you sure. Know, but you can't, but nowadays you can't expect for a man to take care of everything 100% when you got a woman sitting there working full time. <laughs> right. Doing 100% for the house. Exactly, right. right. That means right. that, that, mean that y'all y'all right. leaving some shit on the table. If the man's taking care of all the bills in the house and then the woman's sitting there working, okay, no disrespect, not trying to find what she do with her money, but what is she doing with her money? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> right. For taking all if he's responsible for taking care of all the bills in the house, what's she doing with her money? Right, facts. Mm -hmm. For sure. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you would start thinking, you would start questioning mm -hmm. that shit for sure. Hell yeah. But think about it. A lot of men, a lot of women sit there, expect for the men to take care of all the bills in the house, sit there, take them out, spend money on them, spend money on the kids, blase, blase. Right. But then she's sitting there bragging how she's working 40 hour, 50 hour work week. Okay, <laughs> so if you got him doing all this, what, what you doing? Right. Where is the money? And she better be saving for that vacation <laughs> shit. Some. That's what she better. Yeah. Now if she doing that, then we we can fuck around. Yeah. Dude. She set up all the vacations, pay for all the shit. Yeah. It's, it's a team effort, bro. For sure. <laughs> yeah. It's all that's about your smooth, situation. That's a smooth. That's a smooth team effort. Hell yeah. yeah for sure. I ain't, I ain't trying to be funny. How many women actually think in that mentality now? <laughs> yeah. That's, that's a good question. On social media. But, I don't see a lot of men, women on social media with that mentality. <laughs> yeah, that's you know, true. I'm married, been married for going on three years, been dating. Me and my wife been together for seven years. I've been being married, and it's always been, I take care of all the bills. But then when it comes to weekend plans and weekend things, when we go out, my wife's like, yo, hold up, I got that. Yeah, like, we'll that's what's out to eat. For sure. And I go to pull my card out. My wife's like, nah, babe, I got that. Don't worry about that. Yeah, that's for sure. Up. That's what's up. You got a real team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Squat, squat up. Yeah, for sure. That's, that's the support that, but that's the support we're not seeing. Mm -hmm. yeah. You see a lot of women on social media sitting there bragging, I got this, I got this, my man do this for me, my man do this for me, but I make my own money. Okay, so what you doing with your own money? <laughs> yes. <laughs> doing Instagram videos. <laughs> I, 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 straight I, facts, straight facts. Bussin', bussin'. I see you bussin'. sitting there bragging how your husband <laughs> bought you this and bought you that, but I don't see no videos of what you bought your husband. Duh, no, for sure. Exactly. You know, no. That's what you did for your man. That's real shit. That's real shit, though, for real. So it's, some, it's probably some women out here listening right now that probably need to take that into account. I want to hear from them. They could be pissed off at me all they want to, but I'm just speaking how it is. What I see on social media, between IG, Facebook, Snapchat. Right. For sure. All that shit. Yeah, I want to hear from them. <laughs> All right, Joe Shea, hey, it was good hearing from you, dog. Appreciate you, boy. Right, hey, hey, we need we need some more of them, uh, yeah. Snacks. <laughs> you need some more well, of them snacks. Uh, things are kind of, things are kind of changed with me right now. I'm, okay. I'm actually a culinary instructor right now. Oh, shit. All right, so, so we can't, we can't have those snacks right now. Oh, yeah, no, we can get the snacks, so We can get the snacks because I'm actually on a better schedule, but okay. let me get my kids situated first, and then I'll go ahead and hook y'all up with some more snacks. No doubt. All right, guys. I got it. For sure. All right, fam, y'all stay up. You, you too, dog. For sure. I agree with what he said. No, like for that. sure, yeah. Because that's real shit, though. One of, you know, kind of like the deal I got, like I said, you know, I take care of the main shit. Yeah. If I'm not buying socks and bras. <laughs> you can say you ain't doing all this shit, though. No, I mean, because that's where, you know, the other half comes in. Yeah. You know, I take care of everything else. As long as you got the kids situated, yeah. I'm good. Right. Everything else will be, you know, everything else will be gravy. Yeah. You know, that's what, you know, Mark was saying, you know, that team shit, that team shit, mm -hmm. nigga. Yeah. That's what that is. Nah, man. team shit, that's some real shit, though. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, it's like, it's, it's a real thing. This nigga shy. <laughs> this nigga only worried about himself. Oh, selfish ass nigga. You talking about, damn, that won't affect my show, will it? God damn. You talking about <laughs> us being banned from YouTube. No, nigga, it's not going to affect your show. Oh, it's just a, man. it's just a live stream, nigga. We can still, we can still upload your goddamn show, is nigga. He, is he the new <laughs> damn, all right, star? motherfucker. <laughs> Like, like fuck y'all, this is gonna affect my show. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga, right? Oh, goddamn, nigga, it's more, I swear to God. Be a straight star studded, ain't he? No, for real. Uh, reverse aging veteran just checked in. What up, though? 
Uh, Portia, what up, cuz? She said, I believe we both uh, contribute to provide, maintain, enjoy life, build all of, uh, all of it, not 50-50, give 100%, period. I got it and he got it. That's for sure, dog. And no, that's what, uh, that's what I wanted to say about that shit. Like, we was talking about it last night. Um, I don't... I don't necessarily expect financial stability like because i think when you say financial stability you're saying like basically ain't ain't no ain't no debt for real like your credit a1 like that's not that's not gonna happen all the time like if that shit happened then you got motherfucking lucky but for me it's just the uh it's just the awareness of your situation because i know um i definitely can't be like that because my credit was fucked up you know what i'm saying I, and i knew it so i had to work on that shit and start you know taking the steps um, you know to, to make it better so that, like for me it's just that uh, that that ability to have accountability if that makes sense so like if you gotta if you know your credit fucked up then own that shit your shit fucked up do what you gotta do to fix it and keep it moving and shit you know what I'm saying that's just really all it is but if you're not even if you're not even go be able to acknowledge the fact that you got like let's say poor spending habits or, or whatever and shit then we go already have a problem it's gonna be an issue you know stay in the hole you yeah you're saying? gonna stay in the hole because it ain't, it ain't just me no more it's we you know what I'm saying? yeah for sure yeah. yeah my man both said i need her to have some savings too if you ain't take nothing else from the pandemic save some money that's for sure those name brands don't matter in the end <laughs> that's true though yeah i'm just and i'm for real like i'm old as hell i'm just really getting hip to that dog like really yo uh, debt to income ratio nigga. like it's, that shit got to be it's got to I ain't gonna say it's got to be A1 but you gotta consider it mm -hmm. like you, you just can't be taking on more debt than the assets you, that you actually have cause I did that shit in my 20s and, and a lot of my 30s <laughs> but I got it figured out after that shit dog you just can't be spending what you ain't got dog for real um, my man Tony the Barber just checked in what up though uh, <laughs> shit uh, what, where was it though Bay Area somewhere I can't never remember it's East something <laughs> Somewhere in the Bay Area. Shout out to my, my man Tone. Set the Tone podcast on YouTube. Uh, I guess he can still go live. We can't and shit because we banned. Right. Fuck YouTube. Oh, that's my man out in Oakland. Yeah, mm -hmm. not uh, Oakland. Uh, one of them motherfuckers. The out. It's the Bay out there somewhere. Yeah, well, shout I can't. Out to him. Yeah, I can't never fucking remember. <laughs> what up though? Shout out to the Bay. Yeah. Yeah. Tell us where you at, bro. Yeah, you the right. Um, beer and sweets. Uh, my man Joe DeVette said uh, I showed my wife how to invest. Dog, that's another thing. Um. I like I don't know the the all the the hundreds the ins and outs of motherfucking investing and shit, but I'm learning. Like I'm I'm learning. I'm picking up little stock tips. Uh, shout out to my man, uh, our, the corner boys and shit. Mm -hmm. uh, my man Fedora and shit been putting me up on game. But um, I think that shit is important though. Like to even have those conversations. I mean, at some point uh, we had an age now that that those are the conversations you got to be having mm -hmm. each other. Like, hey, you want to fuck around with these stocks like we got this extra couple of dollars like you want to go fuck around tonight or you want to invest in these couple of stocks like sometimes you got to make those decisions because at this point especially if you got a family like kids and shit like you really got to start uh making decisions based on on them you know mm -hmm. what i'm saying i'm in a position now that I don't, I don't have to worry about that shit uh not yet unless there's any project twins and shit that's gonna be popping out, yeah, yeah. popping out you know at some point but uh <laughs> hopefully hopefully not because i'm not financially stable yet but i i am uh fiscally responsible now so see that's that's where i'm okay, at with okay. it. you know what i'm talking about but um yeah so i think those are conversations that need to be had and like if you if you're interested in a like especially if you just now dating somebody like just y'all y'all starting out then you kind of know what you're getting into at this point so right now is the time to have that conversation because like it, rea in reality you don't want the financial situation to be the thing that drive you apart but like you got sometimes you gotta address it cause like if it was a woman and yo you had a fucking 420 uh, 420 credit score and wasn't trying to improve your credit she'd get rid of your ass in a heartbeat, in a, heartbeat. Yeah. a fucking heartbeat because you sure. want more you know what I mean like you yeah. want more it ain't, it ain't about it ain't about it ain't about having the, the finest things and the Versace and all that shit it's about being financially stable you know what yeah. I'm saying I don't give a fuck about no Gucci and Fanachi and all them other I don't even want to be stable no more I want to be financially Progressive. Okay. I just made that up. Yeah. But it sounds sweet though. It sounds good. It sounds financially good. progressive. It's, it definitely, it definitely <laughs> sounds good. Hell yeah, it sounds good. Financially comfortable. Yeah, I don't want to be comfortable, nigga. I want to be progressive, nigga. I want to be aggressive. I just want to be financially <laughs> comfortable. Just That's it. I'm just saying. It's though, the way, nigga. Like, I'm sorry. I'm just saying though, like motherfucker, gotta just gotta think about this shit. Like you want more for yourself. You want to go on trips. I want to go to Japan. I'm going to Japan before you I get fifty. You swear it's fucking Japan, man. Before I get fifty. Mm -hmm. This nigga wants some of the goddamn ramen, ramen, whatever. Ramen. <laughs> what it is. 
Let me know when you go, cause uh, I remember I said that was on my bucket list. We all niggas can have Japan, cause I'm straight. Quan just checked in. What up, though? E block in the building. What What's up, up though? She What's said up, uh, it's very important. I feel like if we want to live comfortably, we both have to have our own to bring to the table. I've been in a relationship where I took care of everything, and that was horrible. Never again. Damn, it's women out here who take care of everything. No, I couldn't. I couldn't have that. Man. I don't think I. That what shit. Did, what did he I, do then? Dude, shit. Right, what did he do? Like, I would not drink all the juice boxes and playing NBA 2K and shit. Or what, what, what did your Madden. time go? I don't know. That nigga better had a perfect season. Like <laughs> perfect all, season in 2K. Nigga. Eating all the lunchables and shit. Hmm. Kool Aid gone. Like, what, what the fuck was he doing? That just got me baffled. Like, you got to take care of everything as a woman. Right. Everything. Nah. Like, what <laughs> was he doing? She said he ain't do shit. Shit. <laughs> I couldn't even, I wouldn't even feel that. Like, yeah. hey, this is Michigan. It's a lot of grass and there's a lot of snow out there. Nah, something. You're going to shovel some snow, do something, dog. Yeah, I, I couldn't, I couldn't just sit back and, you know, have my lady just take care of it. Nah. Nah. The only, sure. only way that, 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 that'll that happen is if I'm ill. Yeah. Sick. Can't go to work. That's yeah. the only way. I, you know, and even even then, it, you know, if that's the case, then I'm just going to take care of the shit that's in the household. Yeah. You know, I, I just turned into a daddy baby daycare some shit. <laughs> My nigga Jay say he must be laying great dick down. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, aggressive yeah, dick like good morning, yeah, beautiful. Good morning, dick. Dick. <laughs> dick. <laughs> dick. How was your afternoon, baby? Dick. <laughs> <laughs> Aggressive dick, nigga. Uh, <laughs> and then I, I, and then I'm gonna give you some of this Fortnite dick. I'm, I'm a Fortnite. Fortnite. Fortnite yeah, ain't fucking the same time. <laughs> My man Boss said. I'm playing the game, man. Fucking the same. My man Boss said the best tip I can give about investing is start now. Uh, even if it's ten dollars, turn it into twenty five by the end of the month. For sure, I feel that. Uh, he also said, don't listen to the media. Do your own research. That's for sure, dog. I definitely got to do your own research. If I'd have been doing my own research, I'd have known that the game stock, stock was about to fucking explode, but I wasn't paying attention and shit. You know what I'm saying? But it's all good, though. You know, we live and you learn. Uh, she said, also, it's because uh, I was young and dumb and felt like I was supposed to do it. I did it. That was the lesson for me. Damn, that's... So, like, I got a question, though. Like, since uh, it's almost over and shit, so we go get this question in real quick. Uh, Quan, since you said that, like, that was your lesson learned, I'm curious now. How did that affect you in the next relationship? Like, when you went to the next relationship, were you w less willing to, like, actually contribute? Like, at that point, did you just want to be completely taken care of because of the experience you had before? Or, like, you know, how did that, you know, yeah, how did that shit work out? You walked into it with your guard up, like... Yeah, because yeah. I figured you would have. If yeah, a nigga, yeah. like, sound like he basically took advantage of you. Yeah, so, yeah. then you, by the time you get to the next relationship, like, damn, do that make you clam up and shit? Like, just not want to fuck around, period? Like, I kind of want to know. So if you still listen to Kwan, you can answer that question, dog. Um, it is uh ten fifty six though. It's almost time to get up out of here. Uh, you know, niggas gotta get to their uh gotta get to their places of employment and shit. So we gotta get out of this bitch on time, dog. And ain't nobody on YouTube. God damn it, I can't. I'm, I'm mad about that shit, dog. It's weak as fuck. But it's cool. We go upload it to YouTube uh in like the next ten minutes, so it'll be available on YouTube. Yeah, Just won't be live. Niggas won't be able to comment and shit. Weak as hell. Yeah. Whatever though, dog. Yeah, <laughs> we're still out here though, man. Yeah, Check us out, out though. It'll be uploaded on YouTube. All soon. the shit that's going on on YouTube, you ban us for that, dog. I'm tell like ban though. Like I can see getting a strike, but goddamn, nigga, we banned until fucking uh May. Like, are fucking you serious, YouTube? All the shit yeah. that's going on YouTube, man. Yeah, I know. Uh, my man Tom said uh, that has to to do with communication though. A person's only going to accept. What they allow That's for sure exactly. That's that's all day yeah. I tell women that shit all the time Yeah, yeah. Like talking about What a nigga did to you Like shit What you allowed that nigga to do You let him do it <laughs> Hell yeah, yeah For sure That's because the thing shit, You gotta win us Some shit you didn't like You supposed to be uh, uh, Bring it to his attention Let him know you ain't like it If it happen again Nigga what the fuck You want me to do now At this no, point Bring it to his attention now Yeah don't wait Don't wait though no, For real Cause niggas can't read minds man We not mind readers bro Like I understand that sometimes bro Like I suppose to know Right Oh, I don't suppose to know. I don't, do. motherfucker. That's why you gotta, sometimes you gotta tell these women, dog. Shit, I like head, but I can't see inside yours. <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good one, huh? <laughs>
<laughs> y'all niggas, y'all niggas want to use that. That's some free. That's some free game for y'all. All right, say so keep that. One. Yeah, that's keep some that free one. game for y'all, dog. Tell your woman and shit, dog. You like head, dog, but you can't see inside of them, dog. For real, that's one for the road and shit. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Take, All right, we, that. take <laughs> that. Take that. Take that. Take that. We about to get up out of here, man. We got a couple minutes. If you got a last minute comment, man, go ahead and hit me in the comment box. Uh, if you on Facebook. Or yeah, if you're on Facebook, <laughs> yeah, hit me in the comment box. If you're on IG Live, you can actually hit that join button and come in live and talk shit like in the motherfucking studio, dog. Right Quan, she said I was a, a lot more cautious. I had a wall up, that's what I figured. But my relationship now, I told him all that I have been through, and he understood why I'm so guarded now. But he has proven himself to be a real man, real and because man. that that does more <laughs> than he really has to. I take care of things with ease. And I'm happy and not stressed like I was before. That's what's up, dog. Sound I'm like, happy for you. Sound yeah, like yeah. wedding bells to me, man. Yeah. <laughs> I'm get, happy for you. Just shoot us the invitation. Yeah, yeah. I want to I wanna do the reception. Is it right? <laughs> Sign me up, boss. <laughs> Cha-ching. Uh, my man, boss, said traineruniversity.com has good resources to learn some basics. All right, so we talking about uh, we talking about uh, learning about stocks and trading and things like that. Trader University. Dot com. All right, so check that out, man. If y'all want to have some good financial conversations with y'all soon to be mates or the mates that y'all already got, we about to get up out of here, dog. It's been a good ass conversation, though. Angry man, still a final sentiments on the way out, bro. Look at here, man. As a man, you know you, you should want to at least contribute something. Mm -hmm. You know, it, it, you might be in a situation where you know your your lady make more than you, but as long as you can take care of yourself, yeah, you know what I mean, you should be fine. Facts. You know, I mean, even you know, even if you make more, you know, what I mean, that 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 don't mean you degrade and you know, rule with an iron fist. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But you know, like I said, to each his own. You know what I mean? Some mm -hmm. some people think like you know, shit. Like I said earlier, you know, my, uh, you know me, you know, I, I'm gonna take care of the major shit. I'm not buying no other shit. Right. You know what what I'm saying? No, if I, no, I mean, and I'm not saying that to say it, 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 it won't change. Yeah. It, 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 you know, but like I said, if I'm doing this, you need to do that. You know, that's what For I'm sure. saying. Yeah. But I'm always gonna put myself in a position where I can take care of myself. Yeah. And I'm gonna teach her to put herself in a position where she can take care of herself. Yeah. Especially, especially if we got kids, <clears throat> because you know now your kids saying that okay, mm -hmm. you know I got a daddy that you know pretty much take care of everything but my mama also can do some shit too right you know those are untold lessons to, to your kids you know, yeah, they, can, they can see it you know what i mean they, they they can see it okay if this don't you know the older they get if this don't work out my mama can take care of herself my daddy can take care of herself mm -hmm. but together they taking care of everything Right, you know I mean, Facts. It's, it, it's a lot of lessons in there that especially if you have kids that yeah unspoken lessons for sure yeah you know what i'm saying you know, and, and, and that's important to these motherfucking kids. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's why I do certain shit that I do. You know, yeah. that's why I cook. Yeah. You know, that's why I wash clothes. You know what yeah. I mean? I want my daughters to see that, okay, just because, you know, he a man don't mean that he can't do shit. Yeah, you nothing. Know, you know what I'm saying? You know, I don't want my daughters to grow up thinking that, you know, she got to be a cave daughter. And shit. A cave daughter? <laughs> I know what you said. Though. You know what I'm saying? Got got to be be no cave cave wife and shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Just sit back and just you know do everything, and all he do is go to work. Yeah. No, he can get up off his ass and cook some goddamn time. He can get up off his ass and go wash some goddamn clothes. He can get up off his ass and go wash some dishes. Yeah. You know everything is fifty fifty. I feel you. I, I ain't gonna lie to us. <laughs> I I don't cook much so. I do the other shit though. I don't cook much though. Anyway, my fuck. Go ahead. No, no final I mean, no. I mean, but I feel you said. But but what what's the word you used? Mm -hmm. I don't do it much. Right. That means you will do it. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. I don't. So I don't die. Yeah, but you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I will make a motherfucking part time. You know what I'm saying? I just do shit, you know, because I don't want my daughters to settle. Yeah. You know, I don't want them to, you know, feel like they got to just <coughs> be up under a nigga that can't do shit. For sure. You no, know I mean, I ain't doing. saying you ain't got, well, I ain't got to get in the kitchen, you know, every goddamn day, but, yeah. you know, two, three times out the week, you know, I yeah. get my ass up in there, okay, I know I got this. Daddy cooking dinner tonight. Yeah. Or, For sure. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. that, that, that's be done, what up? Be done, daughter. What up, though? Yeah, that's the point I'm getting at. Yeah. You know what I mean? I figured, dude. Mug Body dog. Huh. Final sentiments on the way out, bro. Man, let me tell you. If you want a bum bum motherfucker, you know what to look for. 
a bum motherfucker. You want a bum motherfucker? You know how to find them. They out, they out here. You know what I'm saying? If, if, if that's what you want and you, and you know you get in that situation, don't get upset because you got with that bum motherfucker. Because if they don't want nothing, you know what I'm saying? And Shout if, out to the bum motherfuckers. If they don't want nothing and you can't motivate them to get anything, what is the point? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, what is the point? You know what I mean? Like, you supposed to, like, I, like, like I said, though, it's, it's, it's a team effort, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You got to motivate each other, bro. You know what I'm saying? Pat each other on the back. Damn, you did that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. like, like, like he said, if 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 I'm paying the, the fit, you can do the rest of the shit. And we did that shit. Now let's go to Jamaica. You right. hear me? Right. You know let's what I'm saying? Let's here. get the fuck on for a minute. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. it, it's 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 definitely a team effort, bro. Yeah. And, and everything that come with team come with the relationship bro Sorry. you know what I'm saying like everything come with a fucking you have to do this shit together cause it's not no me no more yeah. it's we you know what I'm saying it's True. definitely it, I come with these motherfuckers they coming with me regardless yeah. wherever sure. I go they gotta go you yeah. know what I'm saying? Facts. No, I feel you on that shit. Mean? And, and people got to understand that. And, and why not want more? Why why not want a little more? Right. You know what I'm saying? Mean, you should. Uh, why yeah. not want a little more for your family? You know what I'm saying? You should. You know what I yeah. mean? Like, but like I said, if you know you got a bum motherfucker, <laughs> and you know what you gonna get. You know what I'm right. saying? So no, don't so don't be surprised when you get this mama. Man, I have been with this mama for how long? You been with the mama for? <laughs> <laughs> wasting time, bro. Right. You know, you wasting time, bro. And I and I feel like a lot of sh- we waste a lot of time in our in our lifespan anyway. Yeah, you know what true. I'm saying? For real. But just waste it wisely. So all I can say. <laughs> waste it. How do you waste it? Waste it wisely. Don't be wasting up on no bullshit that you can like say. Waste it wisely. <laughs> <laughs> the waste it wisely, motherfucker. Because if you waste it, just. Yeah. With this bum, y'all stand in the box and stand in the box, dog. And shit in the box. Anyway, and, uh, what's the point of that? <laughs> what's the point of that? <laughs> you gotta, you gotta want more for yourself and that your partner, though. Honestly, uh, uh, where's the wise movement? Kind of makes sense. I mean, I know what he's saying. It yeah. just sounds funny as fuck. I mean, it's like, what, what if you get sick and shit? Yeah. You need somebody to carry the weight. Mm-hmm. But what if she gets sick and can't yeah. go to work? I feel she gonna depend on you to carry the weight. Yeah, no doubt. You know what I mean? But like I said, like he said, man. Split that shit down the middle. Yeah. I feel that shit, man. On, on that tip, though, we go, we gonna round it out. And my whole thing is just, you ain't got to be financially stable, but you gotta be, you gotta at least be uh, cognizant of what you got going on. So like, if you got a four twenty motherfucking credit score and you're not at least working on it, then we got a problem. Like, I can't fault you for having a fucked up credit score if you made a, a few bad decisions, maybe uh, some cars, and maybe even a house. Like, I don't know. Uh, you might have fucked up your credit, but you working on it to get it together. Then that's cool because that shit, like, that's not just finance, though. That's just about, like, life responsibility. That, like, show that you got some initiative to do the responsible thing. Because at, at, at the end of the day, when you're trying to make it like a whole family... Like niggas, niggas gotta be responsible. Like you gotta, you gotta at that point start making responsible decisions. If you can't make a responsible enough decision to at least try to clean your credit up, knowing that that's gonna kind of dictate the things you can have and the things you can do in life, then we got a problem. So yeah, just uh, as long as y'all both educated on it, cognizant of where you are, and got your eyes on the prize of where you want to move forward, then I think it'll work. You know what I'm saying? But uh, on that note, dog, we about to get up out of here, dog. I want to thank everybody. Who checked us out today on you uh, <laughs> on Facebook and fucking IG, uh, YouTube? We uh, we banned and shit. I think we go. I'm gonna I'm gonna get a new intro now and shit. We go. I'm gonna get a dog ass, hard ass, thug ass trap beat and shit. And we gonna put banned from YouTube on that bitch, dog. That's how we gonna do that shit, dog. We, that shit coming on Friday. But um, yeah, so we banned we banned from coming on live. But if you are watching this right now on YouTube uh, on the replay, then still comment below. We won't read it until probably the next day. But it's cool. You can still right. you can still comment the shit. Um, Easy Street Saloon today. Please. Seventy five cent wings, dog. Pull up one six one zero one East Ten Mile man. Road, dog. Yeah, Pull up, get the motherfucking wings, dog. Chef to your doorstep, still slinging chicken out the kitchen. Yeah. So hit my man's up on uh, Chef to your doorstep on IG, man. Hit him in the uh, comment, I mean the inbox, and get you a quote for your own little hookup today and shit. Sure. Come cook in your motherfucking uh, shit. You All of me your shit. And if you got a pizza oven like uh, my man said, shit, you come do a. I'll make some pizza. <laughs> you come do a pizza. You would not you got be disappointed. Dude. Trust me. You Big Dun Dotter said, uh, I'm sad I missed uh, most of this episode. It's, it's all good, though. You can go to eblockradio.com and watch the whole episode in about uh, one hour. <laughs> it should be up there, so you can uh, check us out there. You can actually see the whole feed. You ain't got to just look at the side of my face, so that's cool. Um, Till the next time, dog. We about to get up out of here, dog. 
again, thank everybody for checking us out, man. Continue to support. Don't forget, down in the uh, description is a link to our Patreon. You can become a patron for as little as five dollars or as much as fifty million if you would like. Million. Uh, uh, e Block Radio Podcast, man. You see the cash app right there, man. If you want to support you guys, uh, hit us in the cash app. Dog. We take any donations. You feel me? Fifty million. Uh, she said, yeah, your face is cool. I'm like, hey, okay. Don't, don't be telling me about my face. I'm in your inbox. I'm, tra- I'm looking for Project Twins and shit, and I'm working on my credit. Don't fucking play. <laughs> <laughs> don't fucking play. All right, we about to get up out of here, dog. Until the next time, bro. You already know what it is. The Live is Cloud Radio Show on the planet. Earth, cuz. Straight from the E-Block Radio Live on your dial, man. This is the Wake and Bake Show. I got my man, Angry Man, in the building. Fuck with my man, man. Get that chef at your doorstep. You For sure. I'll be disappointed. No sure. doubt. Sure. My man want money holding it down? Man, show me some love. Support your boy, man. Come on, holler at me, man. No doubt, man. And of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205, man. Peace out, y'all. Yep. Deuces.